What's up guys? This is Josh, Iron Bull Training Grounds. Um decided to make this video after I got done because I had a lot to do today. My workout lasted me about three hours. Um, wasn't my best day, wasn't my most productive day. My back was feeling pretty fatigued coming in. Just um I need to recover better, get some more sleep. I think that'll help me. But I started off uh, deadlifts. I did uh, 45 for some RDLs. Then I had uh, 135, three sets of two. Um, 225, two reps, 315, two reps. 365, two reps. 415, one rep. All of it was coming up good. Got to the 455 which is normally not that hard for me. And I uh, only got one rep and I was aiming for a three plus. Wasn't my day for it, didn't get it. It is what it is. I'm gonna recover, kinda um, this next week, kinda see how we're gonna go about that. Pull back some on the pulling, but um, yeah, I definitely need to recover because my, my lower back, it's not my upper back, it's it's the lower back. It's gone. Moved over to um, block pulls. They went pretty good. Which, I mean, 14 inches up, so it can't be that hard. But I um, worked up in singles. I, then I got up to 315 with two reps. 365 for one. 415 for one. 455 for five, then went back down 415 for five. Then when I got done with that, not everything that I'm going to show y'all is going to be on video, on the video that I made, but I got the main, the main lifts in there. I had sandbag load, um, had it 56 inches where I had the bar at to load. And I just did a set of, uh, I think six is what I did on it. And um, after that, did the sandbag carry. Did pretty good on that. Um, kind of made, I'm waiting on my new sandbag to come in. So I just made one to kind of make do for now out of a laundry bag. Garbage bag, some sand, some duct tape. Work. I mean, it, it's okay to... You know for now until my other one comes in but you got to work with what you got right went over to um country crush deadlift and i'm not sure if everybody knows what the country crush deadlift is but i'm gonna have uh i mean you'll see it in the video it's at the end it's the v-shaped handle handle it's got a uh, two inch handles on both sides of it they're slick and they rotate and um, on that I did 45, I was holding them for two seconds at the top, around two seconds. I got 45, 90, 135, 180, 225, 235, 260, you could tell my, my forearms was blown up, I failed it. Worked down to 245, uh, kind of a half rep, but then I worked back down to 190 for 10 reps. And um, them felt pretty good there. I mean, my weight's moving up pretty good on it. It's it's a pretty difficult handle, but um, it's gonna get better. Y'all kind of see what that is in the video. Lap pull down wrist curls. You just get the lap pull down bar. Me, I don't have a lap pull down here. I'm probably gonna get one. So I used a band and a piece of pipe, and you hold it up. You hold it full extension, but just to show y'all, you grab it, work your hands down, kind of let it roll back up, roll back up. I'm you talking about blowing your forearms up? My my forearms are still so tight right now from that. And um, I did some straight arm lap pull downs, of which I did the same thing. You know, I used a big heavy band and a piece of pipe, and just kind of brought it down. And I mean, I can feel it; it worked. But let me get this handle real quick, and I'm gonna show y'all. What I'm talking about as far as the Country Crush Deadlift. If you haven't bought the handle, I think you should. 
countrycrust.net. Um, it will really take your game to the next level, I think. And I mean, it really helps with the forearm strength, your grip, everything. Let me grab that handle so I can show y'all real quick. All right, as you can see, it's a country crush. That's the handles, two inches. They're slick and they rotate, so when you go to pick it up, it's steadily trying to twist your hands like this. It's pretty interesting. If you ain't got one, get one. You won't be disappointed. They have different handles you can change out on it. They got three inch handles. They got the little block handles. I'm not sure what you call them, but, um. I actually have a monster crush coming in which is a three inch handle i don't have big hands so we're gonna see what i can do with it but um that's enough for now just wanted to kind of give you a breakdown of what i got going on i'm in week 14 of this program and i'm prepping for a contest in little rock arkansas for united states strongman february the 23rd if i'm not mistaken and um if all goes well I'm gonna be there. I'm gonna have my two teens there. My daughter's gonna be competing up in the middleweight women. My son will compete in the teen uh, division. And um, wish us luck. We're gonna be working hard for it. Y'all have a good night.